ever noticed that clear nights tend to be colder than cloudy nights? Sailors used to say, stars bright cold night to describe this. But why is it true? When we look up at clouds, we're just getting part of the picture because our eyes can only see visible light. The full electromagnetic spectrum includes microwaves, infrared, visible light, ultraviolet, and x-rays. The only difference between these is their wavelength. Our eyes are adapted to see radiation of a particular wavelength. Radiation with too short a wave, like x-rays or ultraviolet, or too long, like microwaves or infrared, are invisible to us. We can expand our vision of clouds using an infrared camera. This is the same technology that's used in thermal night vision goggles. In this footage, red and yellow colors are used to show things that are emitting the most infrared radiation. Pink and blue colors are things that emit the least. This shows us that clouds emit more radiation than the rest of the sky. Now let's see what happens if we use this infrared camera at night. Even though there is no visible energy from the sun, the sky looks the same in the infrared as it did in the daytime. The clouds are still emitting infrared energy down towards us. And just like visible radiation, that's sunlight, warms the Earth's surface during the day, infrared radiation also warms the surface. So at nighttime, clouds keep the surface warmer. Greenhouse gases are another major source of infrared energy from the atmosphere. So when we put more carbon dioxide into the air, there's more infrared energy coming down. This heats up the surface and has caused the Earth to warm by more than one degree Celsius since the Industrial Revolution.